Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to some more Terra Genesis episode 17 with our series here and we are looking really good right temperatures nice in a pretty comfortable area pressure going up by plus one but it's never going to be anything to worry about oxygen rate where it needs to be water still slowly going up at uh, plus 30 a minute and which is kind of slow but we'll keep it at that because it seems to be working and uh, aside from that Everything else is looking pretty good with the planet. So we've gone ahead and we actually got another culture point here. And I just get these every now and again for doing various, um, getting various random events and stuff. So we'll spend the culture point there. That puts us at 90% victory. So we've only need two more culture points to actually achieve victory and win the game. Which could be really tricky to get to. I know we could probably get, let's see, 475,000 for, right, for population. So we could probably get one more through population. Hold on. Oh, crap. I got to go check. Yeah, it's 500,000. So we could definitely get one more through population, but we're going to have to get the other one through something else. Um, It's going to be a matter of what to upgrade, though. Uh, we can upgrade this hab dome. If we do that, it does change... The oxygen, the water. The water's not a big deal. The oxygen kind of is. Now, oxygen right now. Well, here's what we could do, right? Oxygen right now, we've got 10. So if we upgrade two of these, that'll give us plus 10 oxygen. For water, that'll give us plus 20 water, which we've got electrosis plants and stuff on standby. So I think that we can offset this. We would just need to probably build more O2 filters is what we would need to do. Now, I've been spending my Genesis points here and there to try to rush certain things that I don't want to be done. Because I could turn these on and then I can disable them. So that way they don't give me a hard time in the future. We do. I do uh, get Genesis points off camera here every now and again. Um, as I do different transmissions and stuff, like there's two there. But I'm not going to watch ads while I'm playing here. But yeah, so oxygen's back zeroed out. All right. So with that being said, let's go to temp slash life actually. And let's upgrade this hab dome. And then we'll go to water and we'll upgrade that hab dome like so and actually with the spaceport here it's going to give us a pretty big population boost so we should have these pretty quickly so that'll give us one more additional culture point then it's going to be a matter of getting the last one i don't remember what the next bracket is up from this but i, I think it's like seven hundred fifty thousand. so that could be really hard to do um hopefully we'll have a random event that'll be a lot better in terms of getting our point you can see the planet here it's looking pretty good i need to we're almost ready to use the biosphere i think we can actually start using it right so if we go into biosphere now we can start doing stuff like adding um aquatic or terrestrial i don't know if we could do it just yet uh i think we need more water but we can mess with it and see What do we want to go with? That's less support offer, but 30% to all tolerances. So minus 30% low pressure. Yeah, we probably do large. Plus 75% health because they're under predation. So projected health is to be 128%. We could probably, and they'll offer some support. 
We could probably spend some money to, to lower that. 128%. Pretty healthy. Let's do minus 15 for health and see if they hold on. We need to pick one more. I guess we'll go low metabolism. One hundred and nine percent. All right, let's zero this out. Actually, confirm, and we'll just stick with the name. All right, so they're endangered, but they're on their way to healthy. Ah, yeah, I see the 128%. So let's go ahead and definitely cut the conservation back. Well, 120, you know what? We're going to leave it. 128% isn't that bad. And when we create the new um, plant, that'll probably, it'll be, there'll be a support for them, right? So we're going to see that actually drop. So let's just go ahead and leave it. Uh, I do want to go here to Temp and Life. I'd like to upgrade both of these. Like so. And I wouldn't mind building another one of each. I think we're only going to go with one of each like I did last time. Balancing it out. I'm not going to go nuts and make like for the biosphere. I'm not going to go nuts and make like 10 of all of these. You know, I'm just going to go try to go one of each or so and just try and get to a point that makes sense. Or I might try to make it to herbivores for both. Get some type of thing going on here. Let's go microorganisms for the water. We'll go plankton. They get a 50% birth rate. So they got the additional birth rate. We want to have them have a lot of support. They're going to be really important underwater. What does that already put us for? See, projected health 119. So let's have them be probably low metabolism. A little bit slower birth rate, but we could probably handle that. If they're offering a lot of support. Invasive, poisonous, ah, uh, domestic, exothermic, small, large, humidity. See, none of these really make sense. We're not going to go with too high a seed level, so let's do that. 132. Okay, we'll. 132. Okay, let me reset them then. I don't think I want to go with that. Ooh, let's go with that. 50% support offered. That's actually a little bit better, I feel. If we do the large, then that's pretty good. Um. High metabolism instead. 119. Oh, I don't know if I want to take the tolerance hits. We could take the tolerance hits. I mean, the planet's going to be balanced out here soon. This gives us additional low temp tolerance, but it gives us a good birth rate. Invasive, but we spend, we lose credits, right? But they got a really high birth rate. One 
119 percent is good if I can keep it. Now, see, that puts him to 132. I wish you could take turn some on and off. I see that you can't, and it kind of sucks. All right, let's take the minus 30% to all tolerances. What's that give it? Oh, projected health zero. It literally wouldn't survive like that. Amazing. Now it says right now 119. I guess we'll go with beautiful. That, that keeps us at 119. Okay. So we'll take a look at that. Nice. And that gives us pretty good for both of these. And they're both growing. They're endangered right now, but they'll get up there. They're at least going up in percentages. So that's good. Uh, both of them are going to need water, which we're working on. Yeah, both of them need significant amounts of water. I guess everything else is pretty good, though. So water it is. We're still working on that. 78. I could probably speed it up, right? Let's go take a look. If I turn off the electrosis plant, that will add 10 oxygen. If I turn off this ice launcher, it'll be minus 10 pressure. Let me try this. So that'll be minus 10 pressure. Do we have the ability to add plus 10? Yeah, I can actually disable these two. And now if I check, and I will double check, heat is still plus one. Pressure, no, pressure's all messed up now. Oxygen's fine, pressure's messed up. Plus 21, okay. So I must have, oh, I know what I did wrong. I'd have to add, I'd have to take away more pressure, so. Enable these. Yeah, I can't take away 10 more pressure without upgrading. So, upgrade that. That's two. That's four. That's six. And then if I build two more of these. No, one more. That'll be 10. I'm just going to go ahead and confirm these. Like I said, I've been doing this because I don't want this stuff to get ahead of me. Because whenever it gets ahead of you, that's when you start to fall behind. Okay, plus three. So that's good. Oxygen is good. Water's going up 150 now, so that should help a lot. Plus three. We could still... Lower that. I think I've got one more building though, right? Yeah, I'll let that one build on its own. Plus three is not going to get ahead of us. So perfect. Okay, but that's our plan. I'm going to go ahead and leave it off here. We've now got some microbes, which are slowly populating already at 5% and 4% respectively. So we'll let those microorganisms do what they've got to do. Meanwhile, we're getting ready to upgrade our buildings so we can get some plants and some algae going. And uh, then we'll work our way up from there. After we get uh, plants and algae, we might even get two sets of microorganisms. I'll figure it out. And then we should have, by next episode, another culture point. Uh, for the 500,000 population, we should have a lot more water. So we're probably a few episodes away, maybe even like two or three episodes away from hopefully achieving victory with Venus. And with that being said, I want to thank you all for joining me. I do hope that you've enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you next time.